Heavenly Father, today, I hold Ryan and Cameron's hands, and I thank you for their lives. I've been privileged to know Ryan since the day he was born. And today, I stand here with the love of his life to share in the joining of their lives in holy marriage and establishing a brand new family. What a joy to have met Cameron many years ago, before their love even began, and to watch her grow and to blossom and both of them emerge as strong and vibrant young adults with an incredible future in front of them. I could not be more grateful and excited for when they leave this place today as husband and wife. Every day a new beginning Waking up in such a world And I'm still holding on Every light that's faded Once burned so bright we chased I've had the honor of knowing Cameron for the past 22 years of my life. When I think back to when we were younger, all I can do is smile and just be happy. Happy at the thought of knowing I'll always have a friend. It's been amazing being able to grow up with you and watch you <laughs> become this beautiful bride. You are so honest, so smart, and so resilient. Never stop being who you are. <laughs> This next step is a very big commitment, so I'm trusting you, Ryan, to know that you'll always take care of my little sister, trusting you to know that you will love her on her toughest days and to always be there for her and for each other to always know when times get rough, don't give up. I hope all of you just pray for Cameron and Ryan every day. Keep them in your hearts um, because we all know that once God is in the center of your marriage, Everything's good. Thank you. I know that somehow in the mystery of God they've been united in the sight of heaven and family and friends who have gathered to witness this moment of covenant and love. This is a day of new beginnings, a time to grow and dream. It's an open road to take together and not alone. We are gathered here this afternoon to witness the official moment of marriage between Ryan and Cameron and to celebrate their union in a time of fellowship. By the authority empowering me as a minister of the gospel, I now declare you to be husband and wife. And what God has witnessed and blessed, let no one or no thing seek to come between you. Ryan, you may kiss your beautiful bride. But I know a love like this doesn't come around every day. It is my Just happy privilege to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Ryan and Cameron Howard. Cameron, I just want to say congratulations. You won. 
After playing this game of cat and mouse with me for six years now, you finally beat me out for Ryan's love and affection. I hope you're happy with him. Ryan, you're the real winner here tonight. You managed to lock down a girl who's way out of your league. So be thankful for that. And Cameron, always remember that Ryan loves you and needs you in his life. Who else is gonna comfort him every time he sees a spider or when the Chargers miss yet another playoff spot? Thank you to my parents for raising me to be able to be someone that can get someone like her. Um, thank you to her parents for raising someone that would like someone like me, uh, whether that was intentional or not. And if we don't get a chance to thank you, let this be that moment. We appreciate it so much and we love all of you. Thank you. Ask you guys to raise your glass to Ryan and Cameron Howard, to a wonderful marriage of happiness and uh, just happiness. All right, here we go. Cheers. <laughs>